All right, what is up, you beautiful people? And welcome back to the Besiege Brawl. We're playing some Phoenix here, and we're joined by Kaz today. Uh, I don't know what I'm gonna start with here, but oh, oh, we're ooh. Let's just hope our opponents are not Rainer. Are we? Are we all Phoenix? We're all Phoenix today, boy. Okay, well, somehow we managed to all pick Phoenix. Uh, Lamau. Uh, we're all Phoenix today. So Brawl Modifiers, we have... Is that a... Who Zergling was that? I don't know who Zergling that was. We have extra life on our structures. Oh, no, there's a Rainer. Uh-oh. There's a Rainer, boys. I was hoping there'd be no Rainers, because Rainers is going to give Phoenix such a hard time. Uh, so anyways, we have, structures have double life, but they have half attack speed, so it's like Lamau, nice beam. Uh, and uh, after that, we have just the aura. So that's basically it. Um, I think I'm just going to go Force and spam Adepts, boys. We're just going to spam Adepts. Um, got space for next round. Arch actually just calling us here just a little bit too late. We just managed to start the game. We got the glory to the Daylom here. Get the psionic projection. And we're gonna go tier two here. We're all Phoenix. That means we're gonna have all of Phoenix's strengths and all of Phoenix's weaknesses amplified, like to the max, boys. Um, that means our ground presence is gonna be pretty strong at least. My single, my single legionary here. Oh, I'm against Mangsk. I think that's gonna have to be Adepts and Immortals. I think is gonna have to be what I'm gonna push in here. Ooh, this is a yikes. A little bit of a yikes here. Come on, boys. I got that extra range with my force. Yeah, the boys are just going to go down to the Adepts because the Adepts are so thick. Um, but Adepts are going to go down to the Fire Bats, I think. Are they? Actually, Fire Bats don't do that much damage versus the Adepts. The Adepts have quite a lot of health, but, you know. You know. I'm going to get Talus over here. Actually, I probably don't. Hmm. I could put an Immortal here. It's like a, like a little kill squad. So I can put Talus in the back. There we go. There we go. We're going to have all of Phoenix's strengths and all of his weaknesses amplified to the maximum. So uh, let's make that happen, boys. Here we go. I mean, we have a large stack of Adepts coming in here, so that's pretty good. Our single Legionary here. Talus is coming in here. Firstborn shall persevere. Flame Boy is doing a lot more damage than, than Fire Bats actually for auto attack. Classic Power Creek boys. LMG boys here. Not really much of a match there. I might just buy a single single Immortal. That or I might just buy Phoenix. I might just buy Phoenix actually. Kind of do need him to like use the Praetor suit to like just die for our opponents here. I wonder what Kaz is going for. He's got, he's got, oh no, he's got Phoenix himself. Okay. There we go. Um, kind of want to go for that gas though. I want to go for that gas though. Cass is like Erm. Um, yeah, we're all Phoenix today. <laughs> I'm gonna put down a conservator actually. Uh, let's put it down slightly in the back because it likes to put the shields down a little bit too close. Um, likes to put the shields down a little bit too close here. Put a little conservator over there. It's gonna reduce our damage. 35% damage reduction is pretty solid. Um, oh, we got some Warhounds. We got some Warhounds, boys. Talus is debilitating system here. Get him with that big bounce, Talus. Well, I don't think, I, like, I just, just, like, I'm going to play some Phoenix, because I feel like we can get some nice Phoenix games in here. And I guess everybody else just RNG'd into Phoenix and or picked Phoenix. I think, I think Kaz has that on random. So it must have been just RNG there. Um, but yeah. <laughs> oh, Phoenix himself gonna launch that little blast before going down here. I think I'm gonna put Phoenix down in the Praetor suit right here in this position. So I'm gonna probably get another Adept there. Uh, and then we'll see. Um, I'm gonna have to let Arch know. A little bit slow on that one, that's okay. A little bit slow on that draw there. There you go, boom. Legionary here just gonna be pushing through. Our force should be quite helpful here. That extra range. Boom. Oh god, but the Warhounds. Ouch. The Warhounds. Uh. 
My sound's boned. Oh. I think Kaz's sound is like not on or something like that. Interesting. There we go. Um, let's see. Could go for a tall darn, but I think I'm gonna save for Praetor Suit Phoenix here. Praetor Suit Phoenix is gonna make a huge impact against Minx. Um, although all he needs is an Emperor Shadow, and I'll be super sad. So then I have to turn him into Dragoon Phoenix. Uh, but hey, you know what? You gotta live the Praetor Suit at least once. Uh, Praetor Suit, you gotta get that Micro. Gotta get that Whirlwind. Probably not on. Uh, oh God. Oh God. Marauders are so star are so tanky. How is this allowed? Oh yeah, because all those medics in the back. Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. R.I.P. Our structures don't clear themselves. Um, I don't know if I need more adepts or if I need less adepts. I think I probably need more, more immortals. Oh jeez. Marauder kill squad. Uh oh, we got a black hole coming in here, and there's a shock division hitting us. That's terrible. Um, oh no. Oh, we got we got our conservators coming in. Well, come on, Praetor suit. Where are we going? Get in there, boys. Uh oh, I don't have any detection here. Just stop that thing. Stop that tank from doing anything. Just stop it. Attacking is not allowed. Oh my god. Get that three three seconds done there. I'm gonna need Tall Darn here, ASAP. Um That's a large army of adepts Kaz has got going on here. Adept Immortal boys, let's get in there. Hey Kaz, take your ought. Your aura. Oh, Kaz does not have his aura? Whoa. I think Kaz is too busy trying to figure out his speakers. Uh, oh. Anyways. I want to put Paldara in, like, slightly behind everything. Yeah, there's some serious stuff going on with the computer. Uh oh. Uh oh. Um. Anyways, Taldarm, get the grab metric overload here. Okay, I'm gonna get our. We're gonna go for a swim. We're gonna go for a swim. How about a swim? Boom. Boom. How about a swim? Stop that tank over there. And there we go. Rely on Kaz Op for now. Kaz OP for now. I hope. There we go. About that base over there. I'm gonna get another legionary at the tip here. Tip of the spear was a legionary. I don't know. Put another legionary in there. Who knows? There we go. I might need uh, some more conservators though. Let's see. Uh, Phoenix on the spin here. Uh oh. I think we're gonna have to uh, retreat our cannons back a little bit. That looks kind of ridiculous though. I'm gonna dive in here. Oh, is that a tank in the back? No, that's not a tank in the back. Anyways, we got our damage reduction coming in the front. And Conservator just gonna go down real fast. Oh my god, what is that ungodly stack there? Taldarin just trying to do his best, but. That's too much, boys. I mean, Kaz got his large number of adepts coming in here. Is that gonna be enough? Oh my god. I need so many immortals right now. I do not have nearly enough immortals. Um, I think I might even need some disruptors. Probably should not have gone for that gas then, I'm guessing. Things are looking a little a little spicy here. Just a little bit spicy. Can I get an iron immortal? I did not get that other mortal. Oops. Alright, you wanna go and dive back here. There we go. Oh my god. Oh my god, the DT is just off me. Oh no. 
Mind control. That's a bit of a oof. That's an oofers, boys. I think I might have needed Colossus. Like, to handle that Manx wave. Kind of take an L after this. Alright, well, Kaz is going to have to figure out what's going on here. I think something's going on. Yeah, that was a little unfortunate. Our uh, Triple Phoenix game did not work out because of uh, technical problems. Well, we still got a little bit of time in this video, so let's go for round two. Maybe we'll get a little bit better here. Let's see. Alright, we're back. This time we're joined by Arcturus. Uh, because Kaz has to fix a sound problem. Something really funky is going on there. So yeah, I'm going to send out a single legionary to scout. Yeah, it's gonna be it, boys. We'll just see what happens after this. Slam down our cannons here. And then we'll have to move from there, boys. Let's just see what happens. Let's wait. <laughs> I wanna wait and see. Uh, anything? We got some creep. Is that Kerrigan? Oh, it's probably gonna be Kerrigan here. Let's see. Boom. And spine crawler, and we have no idea who we're up against. Classic. Um. Okay. Well then. Hmm. I'm gonna just go tier two so I can get access to Phoenix. Stukov, Kerrigan. Hmm. Interesting. Maybe it might be Tychus. If it's Tychus, then it's gonna be oof. Actually, a yeah, depth would be not too bad against Tychus. It's a. Uh, it's a. Uh, <laughs> it's probably a mix. It's a Manx, I think. Oh no. Okay. Well, we got a rematch here against Manx, so maybe we can uh, we can actually uh, fix it this time. Uh, we can fix it this time by getting some Colossus here earlier. Um, let's look at what we got here as well. Fire, blood, blood could be really good because I got some really good. I got some really big units here. Um, yeah, I might just go for blood actually. Uh, but the problem with scouts is unlike mirages, scouts can attack ground units, and so black hammers will focus them down. And I'm gonna get super sad about that. Um, hmm. I could go fire. I'm not sure. Let's see. What what do we got here? That's a max voice. That is a max voice. Uh, oh, he's been discovered. Uh, that try hard microing Kerrigan. <laughs> oh man. No, well, sometimes you just gotta micro, boys. Uh, could get a blood here. Could get some more psionic projection. Don't know. Let's see. <laughs> Fire could be potentially very good, if, especially if I double up with Colossus. Boom. Boom. Silence. Kerrigan's constantly just going to be stutter-stepping backwards here. Fairly interesting choice here. Okay, just uh, turn on the spin move. Alright, there we go. <laughs> turn on the spin move. Turn on the jets a little bit there. Uh, oh, I'm probably going to crash into those other units here. Yeah, I think I'm going to go fire. I don't know. I think I'm going to go fire. Just just because I think I'm going to be spamming a lot, of, a lot of adepts as well. So adepts are going to be pretty good with the fire upgrade here. Uh, just because the depths don't do a lot of damage per shot, but you know, when they when they do land their hits, pretty pretty strong. Uh, I'm gonna get you to become Talus, and then not that. Um, there we go. Carry him going down here, and Aegis Guard just bam. That's the end, boys. Uh, I'm gonna get a gas after I get Talus though. Uh, oh, there's an Aegis Guard right there. Okay, there we go. A little baby lag coming in. It's uh, it's not me. I got 40 ping. Hey, Aegis Guard. What's up? Alright, just turn on the spinny, boys. Turn on the spin. I'm done with this. I don't think I need to stun this guy. Just to let him do his thing. And then... Can I stun those bunkers? Oh my god, I can stun bunkers? That's crazy. Anyways, let's get that simulator over here. Uh, little explodey boys coming out here from Arcturus. Boom! 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 
Oh, one more. A Kerrigan here is just gonna be a little bit difficult to deal and or deal with. Uh, but Aegis God, I think, should put that question to rest, maybe. Yeah, Aegis, no, he's not gonna put that question to rest. Alright, well then, let's just, let's put that question to rest here right now. There we go. Send our Phoenix flying right into them. Okay, uh-oh. Alright, Phoenix. And then flying there to stun. There we go. There we go. Oh, he's got two Aegis Guards now. Hmm. Hmm. Boom, stun those bunkers over there. Okay, well, I'm gonna definitely need some immortals, that's for sure. And I guess against that many Zerglings, I probably could get some Kaldalas action going. Uh, wouldn't be against that. Hmm. Do I want Kaldalas though? Like right away? I'm not quite sure. I think I still need I think I still need Colossus though. Should probably actually get my hands on some. I've been saying that for like the past like minute. Alright, that's enough. We finished our little baby formation here. Could use a conservator as well, but yeah, I'll be fine. We got some tanks over here. He just guards on each side. I'm gonna protect oh I couldn't protect that unit. I was like I protect. Anyways. Uh, Immortal's gonna probably just get taken out here with ease. My single, single legionary here. Boom. There we go. Boom, boom. Come on, Immortals. Oh god, the Immortals are attacking. The light units. Anything but that. Anyways, tier 3, I'm gonna get Warbringer and then we'll, we'll go from there, I think. I don't really need too many Colossus past Warbringer, I think. Um, enemy Kerrigan here diving straight for the tanks. That's exactly what you want to do. Uh, I mean, Kerrigan is quite potent in terms of like how much damage you can deal in the early game. But once you get past the early game, it's like Lamau. It's not really going to be that that much, that much damage out here. Okay, Aegis Guard. More Aegis Guard. More Aegis Guard. I just gotta save this uh, Shock Division here. Oh, can I? Ooh! There we go. Oh, couldn't save it all the way though, but we did dive right on top of it and just turn it into like, turn those Aegis Guard into shreddies. Boom. Okay, let's get a Colossus, boys. This Colossus is gonna become Warbringer. I'm gonna get that over here as well. Um, we got a little Simulant Overseer here. Did they replace his eyes? Bro. They replaced the entire Overseer's face, dude. Man. That's bad, man. Uh, Extend Thermal Lance. I'm not going to get that just yet. I'm going to get all these upgrades here. Uh, should probably get some protection, actually. I don't know. Could use my Cybro suit or something like that. Lurkers are going to be quite lethal here, destroying most of these units. For the most part. I'm going to just drop the stun here. And then just, you know. Uh oh. We've got a tank here now. Uh oh. My Colossus here is not going to do enough. I don't think. Uh. Okay, no, it, it, it did something. I think I'm going to need. Yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to need my Colossus to be Warbringer, and then that should be good enough for a little bit. Warbringer's the giant health pool. And Giga Chrono Lance should be quite helpful. I'm actually wondering if I should get some more Legionaries. If I just keep slamming down Adepts. Hmm. I'm just going to slam some more Adepts and slam some more Immortals. Fe Phoenix and his Praetor suit has 100 kills here. Uh oh, we have Broodlords. Uh oh. Uh oh. Not the Broodlords. Um, Purification Blast? Phoenix is in there, oh god. Purification Blast? Oh god. That is so many units here. Um, it's mostly those tanks I can't get through to. I think? 
I think it's it, it's gonna have to be some Caldalus action. I'm gonna need some Caldalus action. It might be a little too late here. Uh, okay, well, I think we have to pull some trickster with some Cybros Arbiter action here. Um, I'm gonna get Peldar in here. Let's uh, let's 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 micro that Stasis field here, and then let's go invisible. Okay, they're gonna move right past us here. There we go. They're gonna move right past us. It's like we didn't exist. There we go. There we go. And destroy that. Go invisible. Secure that. Uh, get the observation protocol here. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna uncloak now. Um, because they have that going on over there. Cybrus Arbiter there was pretty effective there in, sw in, in switching things back. Oh. Well, anyways, that's a lot of bunkers. Um, but I think Warbringer here should just go to town against them. And all those tanks here are going to be stacking up real hard. There we go. Cybrus Arbiter really helping out here. Actually, I don't know. I don't think I want... I don't I think I want more melee units. I don't think I want more melee range units here. Let's get some more. Let's get some more long range units. Let's get some grab metric overload here. Warbringer here. Get a Warbringer. There's a Sky Fury over there. Just gotta lock him up inside the Cybrus Arbiter suit here. I'm gonna go completely invisible here. And okay, I'm gonna lock that guy up there. Um. Uh, can't really stealth here because everything here is just revealed, so thanks to uh, the cannon there. Once the cannon goes down, we're going to go invisible, and I think they're scanning us, so let's just, let's just up here again. There we go, Cybros Arbiter Micro. Let's go invisible for half a second. There we go, <laughs> we ran out of energy there. Um, let's see, boom, boom, boom. Boom. I'm gonna upgrade my weapons, probably. I don't know. Maybe. Do I need to upgrade my weapons? All I know is that Cybrus Arbiter is so powerful if you guys use it properly. Just like like snare your opponent's detection. And you're basically invisible, forcing out a scan. Um, man, I find with Phoenix, it's just knowing when to turn into Cybrus Arbiter. That's like the most important. Like, that's your swing. That's your, that, that's your swing move. If Cybrus Arbiter doesn't work out, then, uh, oof. A little bit of a yikers. Yeah, other than that, like, should be good. Here, I'm gonna go invisible here. I'm gonna snare up his detection there. Uh, and, oh, uh-oh. We've been discovered, because he's got a scan going. I mean, Phoenix here himself. I'm gonna go, boom, snare up the detection. Uh, but there is the Nexus there, so, oof. Can't do too much about that. We got a lot of Mutalus coming in here. It's gonna hurt a little bit. Just a little bit here. Uh, I wonder if I could get some more Warbringer stuff here. Action. Game's not quite over just yet. Um, I don't know. Let's see. It's close, though. I think I need to buy some scouts, actually. I need some scouts here, because uh, that's quite a bit of detection coming in here. Also, he just needs that Emperor Shadow, and I think we're, we're screwed. I see some Emperor Shadows coming in here. I'm gonna go invisible here. All right, I'm gonna lock up his detectors. There we go. Okay, I don't know. The invisibility is no longer needed here. Oh, held together by duct tape and tentacles, boys. Hmm. That is quite a lot of units there, though. I think uh, I'll need a few more of these. And then I'm gonna get some scouts here to escort our our, our formation here. Um, I don't know. Maybe this formation is a little too vulnerable to splash, though. Uh, I want to extend a thermal lance. Oh my god, what am I doing, boys? I need to extend a thermal lance for sure. Alexander's coming in here. Oops, he went for it anyways, boys. That's what I like to see. Uh, that's quite a bit of detection that he's got there. Gonna lock lock up those detectors there. I think I think no, he still he still has a few detectors over here that are not locked up there. 
There we go. I'm gonna go to invisible here. There we go. And then go uninvisible. Go invisible again. Ah, a little bit unfortunate there, but that's okay. I think I need, if I get some if I get some mojos, like a mojo and some more scouts, we can lock some of those units up. And then Cyrus Arbiter should be quite helpful here. I mean it is also a gigantic flying detector, so there's also that. That's why you don't need to buy observers, alright? <laughs> Just rely on Cybros Arbiter. Uh, anyways, I should probably also increase the combat sensor array. Yeah, I just want to get another scout here. Give me another scout, please. There we go. Uh, combat sensor array. There we go. Let's get some more scouts over here. I'm gonna need some scouts just to draw aggro and just to like, you know, do stuff. Uh, just to do some, do some activities. Such as destroy enemy detection. Uh, come on, drain that detector, boys. Okay, we're going invisible here. I'm gonna seal up that detector over there. Come on, scouts. I don't, I don't know where my Cybros Arbiter is. But uh, we should probably just not be invisible anymore, I don't know. It's fine. Did we smash through that? Oh my god, we smashed through that. Let's just go invisible anyways. Because why not? Oh, come on, hit the base a few more times. Hey. Cybros Arbiter Micro Boys. Definitely saved us from losing the game. Definitely uh, helped us win the game. Like, when we were pushed up to here, oh, that Cybros Arbiter switch, I think, was definitely noticeable in terms of, like, what it helped us do. We took a lot of hits there. Did a lot of damage, too. Man, okay. All right. I don't even have any weapon upgrades here. I think you just got to get more units out here. The heroes are just doing so much damage here. Um, yeah. Well, if you guys enjoyed these two Phoenix games, be sure to leave a like. And until next time, I will see you guys later. The tires, let's light some fires. Need a light. They picked the wrong fight.